What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel, Official Airgun Collector here. So today I will be doing a tabletop review featuring the Beretta 92FX from Amazon. I hope you enjoy. As you can see, this is what it looks like fresh out the box in Umarex logo plastic durable case. I can appreciate that. It was made in Germany, so this is probably one of my most expensive air guns that I own. It's also my number one favorite. And as always, I practice safety first. This is for ages 16 and older. Um, of course, if you're younger than that, if you're out here trying to learn how to use one, all I say discretion-wise is please just train with someone who knows what they're doing, experience in the use of firearms and also air guns. So next up, we're just gonna go ahead and start seeing what's inside. So typical package that I always receive with the inside, we've got a Beretta pamphlet here. It's kind of just going in detail, all of the safety hazards, anything, you know, anything that you need to know about the air gun itself. I always like to read over it. Of course, I've already, you know, shot an actual Beretta at the gun range. So I know my pieces pretty well, but it's always still good to just go over things rather than to be safe and to be sorry. So I'll always, you know, advocate for that. Again, this is a pellet pistol, um, not a BB gun. It's very important that you do not try to use BBs of any kind inside the magazines. Everything is always uh, advertised in the packages that I receive of what you should and should not use. And I take that very serious, especially if you're a guy like myself spending hundreds of dollars to collect these higher-end airsoft pistols. Um, not to say that one that costs $15 is, you know, not the same value as the one that costs more than that. But obviously, you get what you pay for, so you definitely want to take care of it. This came with a magazine, um, actually two magazines, I'm sorry. So I was very appreciative of that. Again, this did come from Amazon, so if you need any type of replacements or anything like that, everything is always listed in the link below. Um, but again, you can get replacements from Amazon. Getting right to the pistol, y'all. I know that's what y'all been waiting for. So pulling it out, I'm not gonna lie, I was pretty amazed and highly satisfied. I mean, like literally mouth drooling and everything. <laughs> No, I'm just playing. But for real though, this machine right here, this is a piece of art, y'all. I mean, it's literally spectacular. It does not have any flaws. I mean, paint job, everything, just good. So from an aesthetic standpoint, I'm very satisfied. I can't complain about anything. Um, the only thing that I would have to say that I wish was a little bit different or closer to the picture from Amazon, it's probably the wooden part. Um, on the picture, if you look earlier, it's shown to be a little bit darker. The wood actually has more of a higher gloss finish or a finish in general. This right here is typically, you know, what you would do after the carving and you don't really put a finisher on there, but it's okay though. Other than that, you know, as you're looking at it, it's a pretty, pretty nice looking piece. Um, I've gotten a lot of compliments on it from buddies and family members of mine. I've actually just got done shooting it today and I'll be doing a field test review with you guys next. It is super accurate, it's crazy, and it's got some power to it. So I know my guys and girls out there who are fanatics with the air guns, you guys will really appreciate this piece, man, for real. The only thing that I have to say, um, if you guys are more into the BB pistols rather than the pellet pistols, of course it's always nice to have some blowback action or slide, but you know, I definitely wanted to get this piece right here because it seems to be selling out pretty quickly and in my eyes it's kind of like a limited edition. Um, but right here is where you would insert your CO2 
I pretty much just use Crossman. Um, pretty affordable. I get everything from Walmart, honestly. Package of like 12, I believe, is only like six bucks. Um, I can probably get about, I'd say, maybe seven or eight magazines off of one CO2. Um, so for me, just being out in the backyard, I mean, I can shoot all day and for nothing. Whole, whole, whole lot cheaper than going to the shoot range, y'all. I promise you that. Another thing that I like to mention, um, if you guys have a preference of pellet pistols versus BB, you know, I'd love to get some feedback to see what type of content you like to see on my channel. Um, obviously, I'm very new to this, so it's different from me, you know, kind of filming everything that I have or whatnot, but I definitely wanted to do something kind of out of the box um, and kind of feel more in tune with all you guys and girls on YouTube uh, because I love looking at everybody's piece and, you know, to see what you guys have collecting. I mean, it's just, it's just amazing um, what humans can make. You know what I'm saying? Like, this piece right here is very, very good. I don't think anyone would be um, disappointed if you guys were to order, order it. I very much recommend it any day. This right here is where you load the magazine. Um, pretty smooth, like I said. I actually did not have any pellets to get stuck today, so I was very, very impressed by that. And again, um, if you guys like, share, and subscribe, I'll be posting a field test review on this. So I appreciate you guys for watching. This is another tabletop review featuring the Amazon slash Umarex Beretta 92FX pellet air pistol. If you guys have any questions, please let me know. Comment below and I'll talk to you guys next time. Peace.